Hello guys, today we're doing part E of my Harry Potter spell book and we have a special guest. Please say hi. Hi. If hi. you can't recognise her voice, that's my sister. She's here because, well, she saw part A with me because I often watch my videos. Um, I don't know why I do. I'm just quite fond of them, you know. But she saw it with me and uh, I guess she wanted to be part of it. Um, so I was thinking, I don't really like this plain white cover, so what I wanted to do, is, I was thinking of red paper, but I don't have any. I was going to grab one of these, crumble it up, and make it really cool. So we're going to try both. So first, let's do the yellow. Um, Matilda, what are you doing, Alexa? <laughs> What's she doing? Um, so we're going to fold this up. Um, okay. So now it's folded up, I'm going to crumple it up. Sorry if that was loud. But now it's all crumpled up, I'm going to fold it back in half. Okay. Now I'm going to grab my netbook. I'm going to check how it looks. Okay. I quite like it. It kind of looks like a small English book, though. Now I'm going to try with orange. Matilda, will you pass me orange, please? Matilda's agreed to be my special helper. And she'll pass me stuff. Okay, what is this one? Okay, there's something on it. But don't mind it. So, I'm going to fold that in half. And then I'm going to open it up. I kind of look like a carrot on the camera, but it's actually bright neon orange. Okay. Now it's all this. I'm gonna fold it back up. Oh, we don't think it's folded properly. Anyway, so let's have this and let's put it in. Um, Matilda. Yeah. Let's have Matilda decide because I really can't decide. Do you like this one or do you like this one? Um, Which one do you like? This one. She likes the yellow one first. Can I see the yellow one it is? I actually really quite like this one too. So I'm going to keep this. And it's like, you open this up and it's like, so it's just a mysterious book. And then on the inside it says, Amelia's Harry Potter spell book. And then you just open these, get the table of contents and stuff. And then it's in the book. So I'm really happy about this. It's just like a mysterious book. And then like... It's just like so crumbled and mysterious. I love it. So yes. So do you really like it? Um, yeah, I really like it. So she really likes the yellow. But this wasn't what it was for. This was for part. What part was it, Matilda? Um, part. Um, e. Yes, good girl. This is part E. If you didn't hear her. So. Uh, um, for this one, the only sticker we've got for part E is Expelliarmus, but uh, I'm just going to do a quick search of the spells I could do for E, and yeah, I'll be back. Okay, so Matilda left, uh, well, someone's doing that, but I found it in Gorgio, so that's what we're going to do. I'm just going to open this up. Um, dun, 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 where are we at? I need to use my bookmark for this. Hang on. I'm going to take out my Anne Frank book, sadly. Ah, I love our friend. Like, okay. Ah, we should just put the mark. Okay, here's my bookmark. I'm just gonna put a high potter one in. Oh, so here's my bookmark. I'm gonna put it in when we end this video. So here is where I'm at. I am at. Oh, hang on. We should add this there. There we go. That's where we are at. If I was like combining range and I was reading this, I'd like keep it like So we are here. Oh, I took a bunch of pages out, but it's fine because we are on this bit. This is the start of E. So we're going to just zoom in a little bit. There we go. This is the start of hang on. E. Let's put E in the corner then let's draw the box around it 
And actually, uh, if you've seen part A, B, C, and D, I filmed them all today. Well, E is right now, but if you've seen all of them, I've actually filmed all of them today. So, yes. Um, let's see which. Oh. XVI, so XVII. XVII. So, this is in Gorgio. Oh my gosh, a lot of them haven't had. The A that I do. The fancy A, yay, because the fancy A was quite annoying. Okay, so Engorgio is the first one. Engorgio may be large as something, but we're going to search it up and like the one movement, obviously, before continuing. So, um, yeah, I was right. Engorgio is a spell that enlarges something. I'm just going to write Engorgio is a spell to enlarge something something oh no i need to like do this thing where it's like keep saying like thing to fill in So, this one's pretty simple. Oh, that's so off. It's like one of those ones where you try and draw like a test tube and it looks like that and like you don't like do it correctly or something or it just turns out like this. So it reminds me of In Gorgio. Wand movement. So far, this series has been really fun. Like, I've been looking forward to this. It just started one afternoon where I was just like, I want to make a whole spell book. Like, properly. And so I just started this and I decided, yeah, I'm just going to make a video on it. Why not? So that's what I did. Bringing out the spell book. Let's put Confundo, um, Crucio, Depulso, Descendo, and Gorgio in. No, Defindo, Confringo, Crucio, Descendo, no, Depulso, Descendo, Defindo, and Gorgio. Let's see if I'm right. Confringo, yes. Oh, Confundus. Crucio, Depulso, Descendo, Defindo, oh, Disillusionment, and obviously in Gorgio. So here is how the spell book is looking right now. Uh, I'm going to take all of this out so I can work on this bit. So let me go check what is after in Gorgio and I'll be back. Next up is Evanesco. But before we continue, I just realised I forgot to do the outline on this. So I'm just going to quickly do that. So the next one is Evanesco. I do indeed know what this is thanks to uh, Hobbit's Legacy. It's the spell for vanishing things. So let's write down. Oh, what's next? It's X V I I I. Uh, X V I I I. Oh my gosh, I'm a a lot. So it oh, is. Oh, I'll hit off a sort of Evel. Eh, no. Evel, Evel. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh my gosh. Oh. I've just realised with all my times playing Harry Potter, whether in real life or in a video game, I've called it Evelesco. It's Evansco. I've just realised. I have just realised. It is Evansco. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Where is my ruler? <sighs> No, is it under here? Yes, it's just under here. Oh my gosh. Why? Why, Amelia? Why? Why would you call it Evanesco? I just really like the sound of it. So, Evanesco is a charm for banishing things. Oh, yes, I forgot to put this in. Charm. So, it's a charm for banishing things. Or vanishing. Um, 
the pulse, so it's apparently banishing. I don't know. Anyways, let's write down. I'm going to time up, says. There is one where uh, I did the outline on the, on the previous Harry Potter spell work. I forgot to do the time lapse, or I, I forgot to put it in when I was putting my videos together. So yeah, I'm just going to promise to do a time lapse. I'm wrong. It is Evanesco. Oh my gosh. This um hand movement is like that's the hand movement. Let me check again. We go just redo the hand movement because it looks very bad. Um, let's put this in and see how it looks. So e yeah, Gorgios and we have Evanesco. Why is Evanesco there? Oh my gosh, this just really annoys me. Evanesco. Wait, there is no other spell. That is like main. Okay, I'm fine now. I think Expelliarmus is next, so time to flip over and check. So, I'm going to take this out, put this bookmark in. Oh my gosh, we're all the way at Bombarda from the taking out. Okay, so I'm going to go check and I'll be back. So it is, it is Expelliarmus, no, Expected to China, so I'm just going to quickly time up that, so yes. Okay, just time lapse that whole thing. Um, I think it looks pretty good. Um, not like the best, because this like, okay, this thing was really hard to do. But I think it turned out pretty good. Um, I kept forgetting that I had to do the fancy A's because it's expected to try them. But next is expanding Opus, yay! Really excited for that. Oh, uh, look, we've already got Bombarda over here. So let's put this in our trusty dusty spell book here. It's already getting very sick. I think by the time I do, like, F, I might have to continue on another book. I might have to do four books. Some of them I might do like green. This is green. I really like. Okay, I lost the page again. Evanesco. Expect a Patronum. Yes. Right here. That's where I've got to. So right here is going to be Expelling Darkness. So we're going to take this out now. I'm, I'm, at, I'm only in the A's now. That's how much there is. And this is getting thinner. This is getting thicker. Okay. So I'm just going to go uh, search out Big Spelly Armis. Like the one movement, the actual definition. I, I should have it down there. Um, yeah, I'll be back in just a second. Okay, so let's get going. So, uh, hang on, please. So, Expelliarmus, uh, hang on, I need to do the page number, so, X, X, 20. Expelliarmus. On the website I look at, uh, it says it was cre created by someone, or Merlin. Mouse. So, Expelliarmus. Is the disarming charm. So let's just quickly speed on to all this. I'm only speed running because like, I really like the look of the time lapse when I'm writing it, just because I just, it made it look really cool. Oh, please don't mind the gouge plaster. It's really annoying. The gouge really hurts. Yeah. Hey guys, just did this. Copy this off of it, off the internet. Looked at my book, got the complete wrong spell casting. So what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to erase this and make a smaller version. And we, and we make, because this could be another version of it. So I'm going to put on it, so I'm going to put it right here, the version that I've got. Uh, 
put them right here when I put them. So that's what they've got. So I need to fix this. Okay. Now, what is like we traditionally do before any sticker? Okay, we ready? So this one, like this one over here, is because of the sticker. Let's get the sticker out. I've got our sticker and let's put it in. Oh my gosh. Fresh. Oh. Belly arms. So, it's belly arms. Like, if someone was doing, like, in a door, like Harry in the movie goes, Expelli Arms. You know, like, or maybe it's Expelli Arms. Like, even in Charms class, when they do the God of Yosa, they do the correct one. <laughs> yeah, so. Expulsos next. So. Like the page number at the top. X X I X Bolso. Okay. There is one in F that I'd like to do, the Phileas, which uh, is I believe the spell that Lily Potter used on Harry to protect him. So Expulso I was gonna go get the definition and one movement quickly and i'll be back bye okay so i've just quickly done this there's no actual one movement for this but expose so causes powerful explosions obviously like expose so Apparently, it's a curse. So, yeah. Curse. So, here's Expulsive. I'm just going to go quickly check if there is any more ease. And then, if there isn't, I'll come back and that'll be it. So, yeah. Okay, guys. So, that is it for E. Uh, this has turned out really good. I'm really excited for F, which is going to be tomorrow. But, let's just quickly put slow. I don't know. Just quickly put that in. This has turned out really well. I'm very, very happy with it. And I'm so happy you've joined the ride. So tomorrow we will be doing uh, F and a few more. Uh, because as Philia says, flippendo, yay. Uh, and so many more, I'm really excited. There's a lot of F ones. And yeah, I'm so excited. I can't wait to see you tomorrow. Oh, by the way, I'm keeping this front cover plain because it makes it look more mysterious and stuff. So I really like this. And I can't wait to see you tomorrow. Bye. Please like and subscribe.